Well, first, you have to make a snowball. Oh, yeah, a snowball. Oh, this is gonna be great. Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hey Wildcats, I'm Sally and these are your daily announcements. The prom committee meeting is tomorrow at 3.50 in room D112. This will be a meeting with the design team. The next BA fan club meeting will be Wednesday at 8 a.m. in the Little Theater. Taylor Swift fans are suing Live Nation Entertainment, the parent company for Ticketmaster, following the pre-sale debacle last month for her 2023 The Eras Tour. They are seeking a penalty of $2,500 against Ticketmaster for every violation of Business and Professions Code. They also allege that Ticketmaster intentionally and purposefully misled ticket purchasers by permitting scalpers and bots to access the pre-sale, providing more codes than ticket allotment, and scheduled the general ticket sale knowing they would not have the quantity necessary to fulfill the demand. Ticketmaster said that 3.5 million fans had pre-registered for Swift's Verified Fan Program, the largest registration in its history. According to Ticketmaster, 2.4 million tickets were sold during pre-sale. I'm so glad I got my tickets. The Auditorium, Lexington High School's digital arts magazine, is gearing up for its December 2022 edition. If you have artwork, writing, performance videos, and other media that showcases your artistic abilities, please submit them to the magazine by going to lhsarts.com and clicking the Submit My Art tab. You can also email your entries to Mr. Samey at esamey at lexington1.net. Entries for the December issue are due today. The NHS Toy Drive is happening now. Bring in toys for kindergarten through fifth graders to Miss Miller in room D113. If you spend $10, you get one service hour. These toys will go to students in need at elementary schools in our district. Hey Wildcats, Lock Club will be hosting a holiday kickoff event this Thursday during all lunches in the Unity Hall. The event is 100% free and any student can attend. The holiday kickoff is to promote a safe, drug and alcohol free holiday season and we will have activities and treats for all who attend. We will have fun games, activities, and an obstacle course, as well as complimentary hot chocolate and candy canes. We will also have a holiday photo booth and props. We hope to see everyone there to help kick off a fun, safe, and drug-free holiday season. I'm Ramsey, Noah, Allie, and we just wanted to remind you that there are five days till winter break. Purchase a candy gram to spread holiday cheer. Purchase them during your lunch through Wednesday for $1. Candy grams will be delivered December 15th. There will be a mini job fair tomorrow in the Unity Hall during all lunches. If you're doing a spring internship, the deadline to sign up is Friday. Congratulations to LHS's Teacher of the Year, Miss Small, for qualifying as a top 10 finalist for District-wide Teacher of the Year. She will compete against all of the other top 10 candidates to be the top Teacher of the Year for the district and compete at the state level. Good luck to Miss Small, we are so proud of you. The Science Department and Science National Honor Society will be hosting tutoring for the Biology EOC January 3rd through 9th at 8 a.m. and 3.50 p.m. in room B203. The DECA food drive for Ronald McDonald House has been extended through Wednesday. January 18th from 11.30 to 2.30, the deadline to sign up is tomorrow. Remember, all items for donation drives are due by the end of next week. This week is Holiday Spirit Week here at LHS, and today is Candy Cane Day. Empower teachers, record how many of your students dressed up today, and remind your students to dress up for Baby It's Cold Outside tomorrow in hats, scarves, and gloves. That's all for today. Have a great day, Wildcats!